As we turn the corner to head back towards the front of Deck 3, we come across a mini creation museum which provides visitors with a scientific case for the flood account. It's an important part of the Ark Encounter because it helps visitors to understand that the flood is an actual account, not just a story. We see a display that first addresses the scientific evidence for the flood itself. If the world was once covered by water, we ought to see evidence of it. And we do. Everywhere. Signs here talk about the massive layers and fossils deposited around the world, as well as other evidences left behind. While secular scientists fail to find mechanisms for the multiple ice ages that they believe took place over millions of years, scientists with a biblical worldview have made a strong scientific case that the waters would have been warmer during the flood. This is due to all the tectonic, volcanic, and other massive geologic upheaval that would be taking place during the flood. Warmer waters would lead to more evaporation and precipitation of rain, snow and ice on such a grand scale that it would cause an ice age not long after the flood. And with all the ice age fossils we find above the flood layers, there seems to be scientific confirmation. Likewise, the book of Job in the Bible, which happened not too long after the flood, mentions more snow, ice and cold than any other book in the Bible. We come across the next section of the museum about another epic biblical account, the Tower of Babel. The signs here show how this would explain the origin of the people groups, their migration, and the origin of languages. As we come to the next section called Ancient Man, it presents an idea that challenges a very strongly held evolutionary belief that man has eventually been evolving smarter. While evolutionists scoff at the idea that Noah and his primitive family could have had the technology to build the ark, think about what the Bible says. God made man intelligent from the very beginning and historical records and other discoveries of ancient technological wonders confirm that this is true. And with their longer lifespans, think about how well they could master a trade. Mm -hmm.